So hello and welcome to another Mr Porridge podcast and today Peyton shall be uh, interviewing me so this is going to be fun I think hopefully we'll see so all to you Peyton. Hi um, I'm just going to ask some questions about the films we've been making so the first one forward to the past the previous film we've been working on how did you feel making that? I think it went on a bit long, not because the actual film, it was more just getting people to come and film Jamie. <clears throat> uh, and but apart from that, it, it, it's, it was really fun with you know, all the cotton my day and it was a big jump for me and my sort of editing capabilities. Um, and I've learned so much from it and watched so many you know, I had to sort of watch a lot of tutorials, uh, and I just, I, I'm, I, I love it. And but it's going to take me probably a wee while to uh, until I can watch it and appreciate it what for, what it is, because uh, just now I know every last frame. So, but apart from that, it, I, I really like it. And do you have a lot of ideas for a new film, more than one way to go home? Yeah, uh, I'm really looking forward to doing more than one way to go home uh, and it's going to be sort of something quite close to me and personal uh, being autistic myself and um, it's going to be sort of tackling uh, autism, uh, siblings, friendship, um, adolescence, siblings, just a a lot of things uh, and it's going to be a short sort of awareness film, probably only about 10 minutes long or so, but it's going to be, it's going to be good. Do you think it will take as long as Forward to the Past did? I don't think so because Forward to the Past, I had about half a script, half a film, put them together and, you know, at the start I didn't have a full story. I just filmed it and then added more bits. Whereas this one, it will have a full script, everything, and, you know, then it will just be filming all because it won't be that long and... You know, you'll be the main character. Uh, then I think that we could do it uh, quite quickly, but not rushing it. The long part will probably be the editing part, which, in forward to the past, it sort of wasn't. The editing part was quite quick compared with all the waiting of filming and all that. Well, I've got one last question. Do you think you would ever be open to more people joining? Mr. Porridge Productions? I think so, yeah. I, I, I would really like to. It's just, it's always the, you know, thing of, you've got to... Know them? Yeah, you've sort of got to know them uh, and know what they're like. And, you know, the more people you have in a film, the longer it's going to take. You know, there was the shot and forward to the past when all four of us were there. And it took forever because we all just kept laughing and everything and then it becomes harder because you've got more people to to sort of, for me, in a way, uh, you know, just watch. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, I would be open to, to people to people joining, uh, but it, yeah, I would. It would be good. Well, seeing as this is going on YouTube, I was going to say that um, I have my own YouTube channel um, called Peyton Edits. Bit of a cringy name. (laughs) Don't mind that. Um, Yeah, so please subscribe. And, yeah. So, there we go. That was Peyton interviewing myself. And, yeah, please uh, check out Peyton's channel. I'll put it in the description below. And, yeah. Uh, thank you for listening this has been Edward and Peyton for your Mr Porridge podcast see you soon